This is Tim Yoder with Fit Small Business. Today I'll be evaluating express accounts for Chapter 6 of the Fit Small Business case study, which deals with project management. This is going to be a pretty short video uh, because express accounts really doesn't do much with projects. You can't track income and expense by project. Um, so good project management software will let you uh, assign estimated expenses to a project, let you track actual expenses to the project, and then in the end, um, be able to compare the two. So the only thing you can do in Express Accounts is to create estimates that you can give to customers. However, you can't uh, assign those estimated expenses to your uh, project. So let's go into how to do an estimate and that'll be the only thing we can do um, for companies that have projects. So let's go to our sales tab. They call estimates quotes. Let's create a new quote and we're going to create it to family bowling. Now this is for a kitchen remodel. We're not able to assign it to a project called kitchen remodel, but we can put in our comments down here, kitchen remodel, um, so the customer knows what this is regarding. Okay, and so let's go ahead, let's add um, some labor to our estimate. 10 hours of labor. Um, let's go ahead and add, say, 10 plumbing widgets. Now there should be sales tax calculated on the plumbing widgets. All that looks good. Okay, so here is our estimate. Um, we have some choices. We can email it, print it, or save it as a PDF. Let's just record our estimate. Okay, and there we go. And that's what it's going to look like. Um, you can very easily uh, you can very easily format your estimates and change the colors and add your logo, all that stuff, just like we did with invoices in Chapter 3. So I'm going to close that. Let's look at our quote list. Um, here I've done this twice. I've, uh, this is the second time I created the same uh, quote, so that's why one already shows as being invoiced. This is the one that we just created. It's still open. Uh, let's assume the customer accepts it. Once they accept it, we can convert it to an invoice by selecting create invoice and you can see it's automatically filled in everything from the invoice all we have to do is give it a deposit account and we can hit record and it's going to record that invoice and so that's it that's all uh, you can really do with express accounts for project oriented companies um, if you have a lot of projects I would recommend getting a different software because it's very important to understand if you make money um, or lose money on individual projects and you can't do that with express accounts okay again my name was Tim Yoder and this was our chapter 6 review of express accounts for fit small business